forecast. Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraka is in the Weather Center. We are ready, Tony, for those warmer temperatures and that sunshine. Yeah, we're finally turning the corner. Even right now, Kim, we're seeing skies breaking to at least partly sunny skies. Of course, it was another changeable day today that featured clouds, fog, a few sprinkles, and now drier weather. It's really not bad. I mean, temps now are in the upper 50s. It will cool down quite a bit tonight, but your Friday night looks fine. As we take a look at Providence right now, the skyline with a mix of uh, well, cumulus clouds and some sun. These clouds will gradually diminish and your Friday night looks fine. Just grab a warm coat. I mean, this, this time of year can still be uh, quite cool, especially late at night, but most areas now in the upper 50s. That includes 59 in Providence, mid 50s in New Bedford. So clearing for this evening and a great weekend. We've been advertising this now for the last uh, several days. Dry and warmer, warmer meaning upper 60s to uh, lower 70s. A smidge cooler if you're going to be taking a walk along the beach, the sea breeze, and really no major storms, at least in the short term. Notice on the satellite photo how you start to see this white diminishing, which is the cloud cover kind of sinking off to the south and drying up. Most areas right now under partly to mostly sunny skies, got a stubborn storm system offshore pulling away. And the weather pattern, when we say pattern, we're talking about the storm track or the jet stream kind of reconfiguring itself into such a way that it will favor dry and warmer weather here across uh, New England. So you see the cool air that's on top of us right now, the milder temperatures uh, off to, uh, to our south and across the Midwest, and we'll get a little taste of that. You know, one reason why it's been so cool of late, a northeasterly wind, which is coming off water off the coast of New England and Halifax and off the coast of Maine, which is still quite chilly. So this time of year, northeast wind is not a warming wind direction. So less of that, more in the way of sunshine, add all that up. And it just means warmer temperatures starting tomorrow. So clearing this evening and overnight, here we are tomorrow afternoon, sunshine, warm and dry, about 65 to 70. This is Saturday evening, Saturday night, clear and cool. Tomorrow, uh, rather Sunday morning, uh, starting off with sunshine and then turning partly sunny during the afternoon, but still quite nice. High temperatures again in the upper 60s to lower 70s. So speaking of temperatures, let's take you through the next uh, 24 hours and notice overnight tonight uh, around 11 o'clock, we're down into the 40s. Uh, jump ahead to tomorrow morning with some sunshine, looking at temperatures at around 8 a.m. In the 50s and a nice warm up. Look at these temperatures, upper 60s to lower 70s in many areas. Just a smidge cooler along the, the uh, south shore and the beaches with a bit of a sea breeze, but uh, real nice. Tomorrow morning, uh, sunshine, 7 a.m., 54 by 11 o'clock in the morning, uh, 68 degrees. And during the afternoon, looking pretty good. Generally low 70s, 60s along the immediate shoreline. Bay forecast features sunshine both uh, Saturday and Sunday. The water temps in the low 50s. Northwest breeze tomorrow. West breeze on Sunday. All right, seven day forecast uh, shows the mild weather extending into early next week on Monday as well with temperatures in the lower 70s. This is more like it. Enjoy.